the marine organism we're going to identify now is the common octopus. If you're diving and you see an octopus out roaming on the reefs or on the tropical waters of the Americas during the day, it's most likely a common octopus. This is because it's the only indigenous octopus that is normally roaming the reef during daylight hours. All the other octopi are nocturnal hunters. The common octopus does not have a dark ring around its eye, unlike its close relative, the Caribbean reef octopus, which does. The common octopus also has suckers with dark edges, but you're not likely to see these unless you have one of their arms draped across your dive mask, and even then you'll probably be too distracted by the octopus clinging to your face to notice this identifying feature. The common octopus, like all octopi, live in holes in the reef. Their home can often be identified by a pile of shells in front of the opening. These are the remnants of their feeding. Common octopus eat a variety of shellfish, clams, chitons, and other gastropods. They use their suction cups on their eight arms to slowly pry the tasty morsels from their shells. They have also reportedly been observed feeding on various fish species. Common octopus exhibit a variety of color schemes. They may be a brownish gray to a mottled greenish white and brown to nearly pure white, which is the color they turn when they are stressed or threatened. They can quickly change their color pattern to better blend into their surroundings and hide from both predators and prey. The common octopus can reach a maximum size of three feet, but most are 15 inches to 28 inches from head to arm tips. They are most commonly found on or near coral reefs and may also be seen hunting in seagrass beds and in coral rubble areas. The common octopus is not a long-lived animal, generally surviving only a year or two. During its short lifespan, they will mate and lay as many as 100,000 tiny eggs to propagate their species. That's the common octopus.